All right, so for those of you that need to go, um, I just want to first just say um, thank you for joining us. We have um, phenomenal training for tomorrow night with Amy Pittman on all about our benefits. Um, if you can hang out with us on the live video for about maybe five or ten minutes, I'm going to just show what we talked about tonight. Um, and so I'm on the live page here now, okay? And this is what it looks like. Again, if you have to go, we totally understand um, but we'll be just about five minutes here. So if you're on Facebook right now, you can actually click the share button on the left side and invite anybody that's in our group page to see this live training. So go ahead and do that. If you didn't already do it, tag your teammates are all in this share button. So that way everyone can actually see this and they can notify um, the team that they're there. And throughout this live video, just let me know if you happen to see, um, if you have a question, just, just ask that question. So this is what it looks like when you go to facebook.com forward slash Twitter. Okay. Um, good night. And as you can see here, I already have one of my accounts connected. So when you successfully connect your account, it will say link to Twitter as, and it's as Six Figure Mommy. Same thing here, this page is connected to a different Twitter account. And so I'm gonna go up here to my personal page. We already know that the fan page works. We know that because, um, uh, 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 what is his name? Um, Jermaine, Jermaine Money Green out there in Chi-Town, Cold Town, he said, already is connected. Now, just a quick tip when you do this, as you can see here, I'm already logged into my Twitter account, okay, by default. I'm already connected to my Twitter account. Boom. So when you're already connected into your account, it makes it easier when you do this because it's already connected. So this is what you'll see. It'll say authorize Facebook to use your account. Hit authorize account. Boom. Now it'll ask you um, link to Twitter as Six Figure Mommy, your status, your photos, your links, blah, 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 Yes, let's save it. And as you can also see, you can have, let's hit save. Um, you can also have your, um, same Twitter page connected to multiple Twitter account. I mean, multiple accounts. So like I have my Facebook fan page here and also my Facebook personal page connected to the same Twitter account. I'm actually going to also link my uh, benefit account that I have to my Twitter page also. Um, and I'm going to go down here. Same thing. Save changes. All right. And let me um, just mute out the line because I hear a little bit of background. Oh, I don't know my child's password can you write down his password for me okay all right boom can you write it down on a piece of paper all right so boom that's how you do that so let's test it out i'm gonna come here and i'm gonna do my best to type at the same time i am literally on the line doing social media training with the number one team okay so let's try it out i'm gonna hit post so as you can see i just posted i'm literally online on the line doing social media training with the number one team let's go to twitter my twitter account let's refresh thank you honey Good night. Um, and we're going to go right here. And as you can see, it works. That's my latest tweet 17 seconds ago. I am literally on the line doing social media training with the number one team. Now, keep in mind on Twitter, Instagram, I mean Instagram. On Twitter, um, hashtags are king. Okay? Hashtags are king. And as you can see... Demetrius just liked um, or retweeted it. Yeah, he just re retweeted it. And Demetrius knows that hashtags are king. This is how you retweet something. So this little like circle icon means you retweet it. That's like share. 
It's the same exact thing as a share, but it's in the Twitter world, it's called a retweet, okay? Um, this is a reply, and this is a heart, okay? But that's not what we're here for. We just want to do connecting. So, boom, that's how you connect your Twitter page to your um, your Facebook page. Now, if I go here to my Finally Benefits page, which is... Um, Oh, I see Jermaine unliked it too. You guys are getting good at this. Getting too quick. All of these notifications. All right, so I'm going to go to my Finally Benefits page, which is this page I use specifically to promote the Amera Plan Dental and the Med Plus Plan. That's all I post on here. All right. I'm going to um, post something. Uh, let's see what I could post really quickly just for illustrative purposes and I can just go back in here and actually delete it if I need to but let me where is the pictures at what in the world okay did I delete all my pictures now this has nothing to do with dental at all and I wouldn't recommend to either even post this but I just want you to see this for illustrative purposes okay I'm not even going to tap nothing I'm just going to press it Look at that. That's a really cool. See, Facebook changes every five minutes. This wasn't even here last time. But anyway, I'm going to go over here to um, Twitter. Again, we're going to refresh. And we're going to see if it's there. Look, I posted a new Facebook page picture. So if a person clicks this, and I just got a new follower for some reason, okay, you will see this is what I just posted. So you see how that works? It's on Twitter. If somebody sees this, they click it, it's going to take them back to Facebook straight to the Finally Benefits page and they can get information about the benefits. Yay! Blah, blah, blah. Okay? So as you can see, if you go to Facebook.com forward slash Twitter, you will easily be able to connect every single account that you have. Okay? And make sure when you do um, connect your accounts, okay, you want to make sure that your accounts, um, that you have everything that you want listed on those accounts. What, what I mean by that is, I'll show you again real quick. Dot com slash Twitter. And thank you everybody for sticking around for a little bit extra time just to be able to see this. Um, oh, I put Twitter.com slash Twitter. That's not going to work. <laughs> All right, facebook.com forward slash Twitter. Okay, so just keep in mind again when you do this that you remember to check everything. So anything that I post, no matter if it's a photo, a link, a video, a note, event. Now, if you don't want your events to post on Twitter, then of course you click um, where you want to click and not click. Okay? Now, I'm going to attempt to show you Instagram. Like I was telling you guys before, you can go to Instagram on your desktop, but you're not going to really see too much. You can't post a picture that way. You can't do any of that. All right. So I'm going to use my son's Instagram because I am using his phone at the same time so y'all can see this. All right, look at Billionaire Brown. To ignore is to acknowledge. Ooh, that is deep. De De Demetrius been on the road today with his posts. They've been so uh, thought-provoking. That's really good. All right, so here we go on Instagram, guys. This is not my Instagram. This is my son, Zykir. Everybody say hi. Go follow Zykir, guys. Zykir, one, two, three, ZHP. That's my son. Um, so if he wanted to share on here now, he doesn't have a Facebook. Okay. Um, but if he did have a Facebook, this is what he would see. So if I wanted to share his post, which is this picture of his little cute self. Okay. You would click here and this screen will show the day that you actually post it to. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. Let's click just share. So he doesn't have a Facebook account which is good because I want you to see what comes up. It says, log into your Facebook account to connect to Instagram. And what you would do is you would actually type in whatever your account is, log in there, and you will be able to log in. Now, I'm going to do mine just for illustrative purposes, but then I'm going to delete it because I don't want him posting on my 
Facebook. <laughs> All right, let me just put in um, my information real quick. Let's see here. Uh, what is my information? And thank you guys for being so patient. I really want you guys to be able to see this. My two. Okay, it's asking me, do I want to save? Um, never for this. No. You are now authorized um, on Instagram. So, okay. So, this is my son's picture, right? I clicked Facebook. Now, if I wanted to click a Twitter, which he also doesn't have a Twitter account because you have to be, I think, 14. <laughs> he hates that I do that. I'm going to put my information for Twitter. And this is good that for you guys who don't know if you don't have an account um, or don't have your accounts connected. This is a very easy way for you to do it. I'm just moving it from the screen so you, you don't have my password and stuff. No offense to you guys. Love you, but that's why they have passwords. Okay. So, we're going to hit authorize at. Okay. Hit log in. Oh, wait. I got to put the password in again. Hit log in. Boom. Authorize. And I'm going to disconnect. So now, if I post from Instagram and I click Facebook and I click Twitter and hit share, sharing successful. Let's go back to um, my Facebook page. And as you can see, the picture is there. Okay. And I'm going to delete it. <laughs> Love you, baby, but you got to go. <laughs> and then I'm going to show you on Twitter. Let's go to my Twitter page. And the latest thing I just tweeted. As you can see, those numbers, click Instagram, boom. See? Same exact thing, all right? So that's how you connect your Instagram. And virtually, if you're on Facebook, if you're on Instagram, you can be um, you can be in multiple places. Now, one last thing I'm going to show you, then we're going to get out of here, is if you go to your fan pages, uh, let's go to Finally Benefits again. Oh, wait, I'm pressing the wrong thing. I need to search for this. All right, so if we go to Finally Benefits, okay, now, and you go into your uh, edit page info, and let me just, wait, hold on, sorry, not edit page, you want to go up here at the top where it says settings, you click setting, all right, and right here at the bottom, it will say... Uh, what's that? This is the Instagram ads, but it should say Instagram. Let's see. Okay, maybe it doesn't. Maybe I already because I already have it connected to Instagram. Okay, here we go. So you can add an account, um, like that. But that's for advertising. I don't want to show you guys that yet because that's a whole nother animal, um, in regards to Facebook, uh, connecting. So. Let me try it one more place here, and then we'll get out of here. Any questions, definitely tag it in the, um, in the uh, section that says, all right, yeah, so that's enough. That's enough for tonight. <laughs> all right, so again, I wanted to show you guys how to actually do this. Hi, Paris. Hi, Dina. Hi, Linda. Paris, I was trying to figure out how to link Twitter. Thanks. Check it out. Dina and Teresa, I'm on now. This is great training. I just started doing my Twitter today. Hey, I can see you from Linda. I see you guys, too. Now, let's go on here. Let's connect all of our pages, all of our sites um, on Twitter. This is going to make you more efficient. And like you, we always hear Billionaire Brown say, that's to still time. Okay. And we don't have a lot of time, especially with it being the last month of the year. 
how about let's be smart